In episode 8 of Classroom of the Elite Season 3, Horikita nominates Yamauchi for expulsion due to his lack of contribution to the class. Yamauchi defends himself, but Horikita points out his deficiencies in academics and physical abilities. She also states that he is not as valuable as other classmates. He attempts to gather support from other students, but they do not side with him. He then compares himself to Koenji, but Horikita argues that their skills are incomparable. Horikita confronts Yamauchi about his guilt in manipulating Kushida to gather students against Ayana Koji. This revelation shocks Hirata, who is close to everyone in the class. Yamauchi tries to shift blame onto EK, but EK denies involvement. Kushida admits her role but expresses loyalty to Ayana Koji. Yamauchi blames Kushida, but the classmates know she is trustworthy. Kushida breaks down in tears, and Horikita reprimands her. Horikita then exposes Yamauchi's connection with Class A, leading to his denial and the request to see his phone for evidence. Yamauchi continues to portray himself as a victim, but Horikita argues that betraying classmates and colluding with the enemy is unacceptable. Hirata disagrees with encouraging the class to vote against each other, believing it is wrong. Horikita argues that there is no alternative, but Hirata refuses to accept this and challenges to find a better solution. He expresses anger towards the class for manipulating the vote and sacrificing their friendships. Horikita accepts Hirata's objections. Chabashira assures the class that they will encounter situations, where they must let go of someone, and emphasizes the importance of thoughtful voting. Uncertainty surrounds the upcoming poll. Although the special exam may cause emotional harm, it aims to promote personal growth among students. The majority of Class D students decided to expel Ryuin due to his dictatorial leadership. Ishizaki, the temporary leader, was forced to gather criticism votes against Ryuin, even though he didn't want him to be expelled. Understanding the class's stance, Ryuin chose not to resist expulsion and enjoyed his remaining time at school. In his absence, Manabe Shiho provoked Ibuki, taunting her about potential expulsion. Ishizaki and Ibuki left the classroom to discuss private points Ryuin had acquired. Ibuki revealed she hadn't collected the points yet, and Ishizaki was hesitant to do so himself, fearing suspicion. Ibuki realized she would be the next target if Ryuin were expelled, so she decided to meet him to recover the points. At late night, Ibuki met Ryuin and asked for his private points, explaining her intention to use them for the benefit of Class D. Ryuin transferred all his points to Ibuki, but before parting ways, he mentioned her weakness against Horikita. Alone, Ibuki called someone to report her success and agreed to meet them in their room. The day before the supplementary special exam, Ichinose gathered Class B and assured them that no one would be expelled. She proposed a solution where they entrusted her with all their points and the student council president, Nagumo, would help cover the shortage. That night, Ichinose called Nagumo to confirm their arrangements, and questions if he likes her. Ichinose hesitated, but Nagumo assured her that he liked her. She ended the call feeling torn between her classmates' protection and following her heart. With less than three hours to decide, she resolved to protect everyone. In Class A, before Ichinose's decision, they discussed sacrificing a student, with Sakayanagi nominating Katsuragi. On exam day, three classes, A, B, and D, speculated about who would be expelled, uncertainty hung in the air. Chabashira initiated a class poll, with students going to the voting room in order. Eventually, Tatsuka from Class A was expelled, shocking Katsuragi. Sakayanagi admitted to lying about expelling Katsuragi and revealed that Tatsuka had no value to their class. Moving to Class C, Yamauchi revealed his deal with Sakayanagi, through which he would receive praise votes to avoid expulsion. However, the results showed that Ayana Koji received the most praise votes while Yamauchi received the most criticism votes, leaving him shocked and on the brink of expulsion. In his frustration, Yamauchi attempted to attack Koenji, but his efforts were thwarted, and he was escorted out of the classroom. This marked the end of the exam. After class, Ayana Koji goes downstairs and notices the exam results. Only three students are facing expulsion, Tatsuka Yahiko from Class A, no one from Class B, Yamauchi from Class C, and Manabe Shiho from Class D. Ryuin arrive and discuss the outcome. He finds it amusing that Sakayanagi used Katsuragi as bait, and thanks Ayana Koji for helping him. Reflecting on the events preceding the exam results, Ayana Koji recalls his encounters with Hiyori in his invitation to Ichinose. Ishizaki and Ibuki from Class D visit him, seeking assistance to prevent Ryuin's expulsion. Ayana Koji explains that the only way to save Ryuin is to collect his private points for praise votes. Ishizaki and Ibuki agree to the plan and manage to gather Ryuin's private points. Ayana Koji contacts Ichinose, and tells Ishizaki, and Ibuki about their visitor. Ichinose agrees to assist in saving Ryuin by convincing her classmates to use their praise votes, while Ibuki makes up the missing private points. 
Ayana Koji realizes this strategy can only be used once and appreciates Ichinose's willingness to help. Later, Ayana Koji receives a message from Sakayanagi. And that's it for this episode, stay tuned for more. Thanks for watching.